That's right, we have Dion Waiters standing by. He is in New York City. And, and Dion, the dream has finally come true. You've been drafted by an NBA team. Talk about the emotion you have right now. Uh, just heartwarming. Uh, you know, a lot of hard work I put in, a lot of dedication and sacrifice I have put in. And uh, I'm, I'm just blessed to be in this situation. You know, uh, the number fourth pick, was that something that you expected? A lot of, you know, mock drafts or so-called experts. Maybe had you a little further down. Is this something that was a surprise to you at all? Nah, uh, not really, you know. A team going to like the person they like, no matter what number it is. And, uh, you know, I can say I am surprised. But, uh, I mean, hard work. And uh, I think any team that picks you, they see, they see something in you. So... Yeah, no question. Was the, was the Cavaliers a team that maybe said things to you during workouts, gave you any kind of positive feedback, anything along those lines? No, I, I, never, even, I never talked to Cleveland. So, you know, that's why it's, it's crazy to me. Uh, you know, I, I haven't talked to anybody. Playing alongside Kyrie Irving, you know, talk about that. Except that's a heck of a backcourt you were part of now in Cleveland. Oh, uh, yeah, man. Uh, you know, just the brotherly love we got already and, and the friendship we had. Uh, over the years, and uh, I talk to him every day, you know, and uh, I, I think he's going to compliment, compliment me well, and I can also help him. So two young two young guards in the backcourt uh, just pushing each other every day in practice and uh, just trying to get better and, uh, you know, one day lead this team to the playoffs and then hopefully a national champion, I mean a championship. <laughs> That's all right. You know, Dion. one quote I remember you saying, you came to Syracuse as a boy and you left as a man. Talk about what Syracuse did for you, not only as a player on the court, but as an individual uh, in everyday life. Uh, it just helped me grow. It helped me grow as a person off the court, not even on the court. You know, uh, just Coach Behan with the tough love he had on me. Uh, Coach Hop, always there when I need him, no matter what. Uh, you know, Coach G Mac, you know, the whole coaching staff, even, even the managers. Uh, they been they they always been there for me, and, and they show me love. Like they show me what's a family atmosphere like, and uh, that you know you, sometimes you can't open up to people, and uh, that's that's the biggest thing I walk away with Syracuse with. Yeah, and and Dion, you know certainly when you were at us, you saw the former players that were in the NBA, the Carmelos, the Johnny Flynn's, the West Johnsons. Now you're one of that guy. What kind of role are you taking coming back to the university in the years to come? Uh, I, I take a lot in it, man. You know, just a lot of great players before me who I watch grow up. And, uh, you know, it's just good to be here in the same position that they were. All right, Dion Waiters, we appreciate the time. The newest member of the Cleveland Cavaliers. Dion, thank you so much for your time. Thanks for having me.